Hello. Let's see how we can dilute 91% alcohol to 70% alcohol for hand sanitizing purposes. Here I have two bottles of 91% alcohol, meaning there's 91% of alcohol in the solution. And for hand sanitizing purposes, it is recommended that we use 70% alcohol. How can we do that? There's too much alcohol in the 91% alcohol. We could add some water. Tap water, distilled water. As long as it is clean water, I think it should be fine. But do consult your doctor if you have questions. In short, to dilute 91% alcohol to 70%, we can just add 30% of its volume, okay, and that much water. And then we're going to get 1.3 times or 130% of the original volume, that much 70% alcohol. For example, if you have a 32-ounce bottle of 91% alcohol, add 30% or 3 tenths of 32 ounces which is 9.6 ounces of water. Mix it and we get uh, 41.6 ounces of 70% alcohol. Okay, I'll explain this later. Now, sometimes we have both 91% alcohol and 50% alcohol. If we need to uh, mix them up for a bottle of 70% alcohol, uh, we can just, uh, well, as long as they, they have the same volume, you have the same amount of uh, uh, for the whole bottle, the volume is the same. See, both are 32 ounces, okay, or 20 ounces. Just mix them together, and we're, we're going to get roughly a 70 percent alcohol uh, to be exact and the concentration is 70.5 percent that should work so if we do have a 91 percent alcohol on one bottle another bottle the same volume uh, 50 percent just mix them together all right let's see why Say we have 32 ounces of 91% rubbing alcohol and we need to figure out how much water we need to add so that the total is 70%. All right, let's see. The amount of alcohol we have in the 32 ounces of 91% alcohol, well, the pure alcohol is, I'll just use a fraction. 91% of what? 32. That's the amount of alcohol, pure alcohol, in the solution. And we know the total is 32 ounces, right? You have a, a, a bottle, okay, a bottle, 32 ounces. And we're going to add some water. How much? Oh, let's just use W, right? W representing the amount of water we need to add. So when you add W ounces of water, distilled water, for example, the total amount is going to be 32 plus the amount of water you just added. That's 32 plus W. All right. So remember, this is the amount of pure alcohol in the in the original bottle. And after after adding the water, we get 32 plus W. Okay, that's the total. And we want this ratio to be 70%, right? 70 over 100. A percent is just a fraction. 7. It's a ratio. All right. Now we have an equation. If you can put it in a box like this. If we solve this equation for W, we are going to get the amount of water we need to add to 32 ounces of 91% alcohol so that we will get 90, a 90% 90 uh, solution. All right, and this is an equation. You can solve it in whatever way you like. And 
and multiply both sides by 100 and then by 32 plus w or if you know the the, the rationale behind the cross multiplication you can do that so in short we're going to get something like this uh, 32 plus w uh, times 70 equals 100 times that whole thing 91 over 100 times 32 right okay and let's very quickly remove the parentheses we're going to end in 32 times 70 plus i'll just write 70 w 70 times w equals well 100 times 91 over 100 times 32 that's just 91 times 32 right okay that's easy now Let's uh, look at this equation, and uh, that's 72, 32, that's 91, 32, right? And we can read, 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 read this in whatever way you like, 32 times 70, or I would say 70, 32s, okay? And I'm going to subtract a 70, 32 from both sides. So I'm going to end up with 70W equals, well, 91, 32s and 70 32s right i'm going to end up with 21 32s uh i'm not simplifying anything and i just want to find a pattern here i'm going to keep keep this 32 so 91 32 70 32s if i subtract this from both sides i will get no 21 32 right so w therefore is and this whole thing 21 no 21 right 21, 21 over 70 times 32. You can put 32 up there if you want to, like that. Remember, 32 is just the original you know, volume. So I can write this as uh, 32 over 7. That's really just 30%, right? 3 over 10 times 32 remember that's the th three tenths of 32 remember this 32 can be anything we could go back and change 32 in the equation or in the problem to to uh to t okay so whatever amount we have everything else the the reasoning remains the same we are going to, we're going to get w the amount of water we need to add to the 91 percent solution is going to be Three tenths or 30 30 percent of the original volume. Does that make sense? In the case 32, of course, we get 9.6 watt ounces. Does that make sense? All right, so we don't have to use 32, we can use any amount. So if you have a large bottle of 91 percent alcohol, say 1000 ounces, and you can just get uh, 30 percent. That's 300 ounces of water. Put them together, you are going to end up with 1,300 ounces of 70% alcohol. Does that make sense? All right. Now, let's look at the math behind this epi uh, scenario. We have a bottle of 91% alcohol. We have another bottle of 50% alcohol and so that we have the same amount if we just add them together what would happen this makes me wonder why why they, they manufacture 91 percent alcohol instead of 89 percent or 79 percent there may be a reason uh, i don't know let's see so if we have 32 ounces of uh, uh, 91 percent okay alcohol here we have 50%, okay? We have two bottles. In this bottle, the pure, the pure alcohol, the real alcohol uh, is 91 over 100, right? Times 32. All right. And in this bottle of 50% alcohol, the, the real alcohol is 50 times 32, right? That's 50%, or well, you can say just 16 ounces, yeah. And if you put them together, if you just add them together, the the amount of alcohol will be 91 over 100 times 32 plus 
50 over 100 times 32, right? Now, what's the total? If you add up two bottles of water, no, two, two bottles of alcohol in this case, we're going to have uh, 32 plus 32, right? And that's 64 ounces. Or you can look at this, 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 this ratio. This is the, uh, the, the, uh, the ratio of pure alcohol to the total in the, in the mixture. If you just uh, mix these two bottles together. So that's going to be just, uh, you know, cancel these things out and a little bit of math to play with. Literally, we're going to have 91 over 100. That's 91 percent plus 50 over 100 divided by 2. Right, using whatever you like, that's going to be 100, 141, right? 141, 141 what percent divided by two? That's going to be 70.5 percent. Yeah, so that's roughly 70 percent alcohol. If you really, really want to be accurate um, for mathematical reasons. I don't think, think there's any practical reason. You can just add a few drops of water. So you get, you lower the concentration to 70. Does that make sense? All right, there's a last scenario let's, uh, I want to discuss. Uh, what if you have a bottle of, uh, say, 32 ounces or any amount? Call it A, okay? A ounces. A can be a thousand, it can be. 5,000 or can be 5 ounces, 99% of alcohol, and how can you dilute it by adding water so that you will get 70% alcohol. We can do the same thing. Let's assume we need to add W amount of water, W ounces of water, and we need to figure, figure this out. A little bit of algebra. I guess you don't have to use algebra, but if you do, it's, it's, it just saves some time. All right. Let's see. We have A ounces. Okay. A ounces. You can use 32. Okay. If, yeah. Let's just use 32. And uh, there's no reason we cannot. So the amount of pure alcohol in 32 ounces of 99% solution is going to be 99%, right? Just times 32. That's the pure alcohol. Now we need to add some water, W ounces of water. So the total will be 32 at plus W. That's the total amount. The pure alcohol out of the new total is going to be, we want it to be 70%, right? Now you can solve this, this, this equation in whatever way you like. Okay, let's, uh, let's write a few things out. Okay, multiply 100 and then by 32 times plus W. So we, we, we're going to end up with something like this. S 70 W, 70 plus 70 times 32, right? Equals multiply. Yeah, cross multiply is fine if you know why it works. In this case, it's fine. It's going to be 99 times 32, right? All right, now we have 70, 30, uh, 70, 32, 99, 32. So by subtracting this from both sides of the equation, we get a 70 W, 70 times W, right? Equals 29, right? 99, 70, 99 apples minus 70 apples, 29 apples. The apple is 32 in our case, 32, right? So W is going to be, 29 over 70 times 32, right? That makes sense? Or oh, you can write this at 29 times 32 all over, like 29 times 32 all over 70. That's fine, because it's the same as this one. I just want to focus on this part. So 32 is the amount we started with, right? It can be anything, as we said. So now, we need to add the amount of water we need to add is 29 over 70, that much of the original volume. So what is that? It's about 41%. It's roughly 41.4. Not sure. Uh, you can check. Percent. Uh, 
32 or whatever. Does that make sense? So it's it, it's it's roughly, uh, you know, take take uh, forty percent of this, uh, thirteen ounces, right? Twelve ounces, a little bit over that. So you are going to get seventy percent uh, alcohol solution. I right, see so the math is quite interesting. Uh, in our case, okay, diluting a high concentration alcohol solution to 70%. All right, just stay safe and do uh, consult your doctor about the safe uses of alcohol for sanitizing or other purposes. And do some math when you have time. Thank you.